in yesterday's video we talked about filer token and how i believe that it was going to go up in price if you didn't see that video you can watch it here after you've seen that come back over to this video and we'll give you an update on that and we're going to talk about wise token because we haven't talked about that in a little hot minute so without any further ado Welcome back to the channel guys, Crypto Lightsaber back again with another video and today we're going to talk about Fala token, which if you saw yesterday's video you will know they actually, that, that I actually said that I believed that it was going to go up and I thought I was, it was quite bullish, the chart was looking bullish, we had this little cup and handle set up over here, we also had the W pattern that we were expecting to move to the upside, so that's yesterday's video and since then you can see that Fala token has actually taken off with some nice bullish price action in fact since we did do the video yesterday it's gone up approximately 120 percent so if you did get in on that congratulations i believe that there will be some more upside for file token however it would be muddy waters getting in at the moment considering this had such a crazy price increase in the short term um if i was you i'd wait for a pullback at this point and then hopefully you can buy that and uh, get some crazy gains to the upside but today's video is not actually a file video if you haven't seen my video on file go and check that out and uh, come right back here but today we're going to talk about whys okay now why we're going to talk about whys is because we haven't done an update in a little while and uh, we can see that the the price action has been maintaining it did look like it wanted to break the 70 uh, the, the 70 cent mark and continue to the upside however that has been rejected and of course we have to look at the price of ethereum also when we're looking at the price action for whys of course we are on a lower time frame so I'm just going to increase that to the four hour and you'll see that it has been maintaining some strength above this level around 56 cents. We're not really in any danger. OK, however, uh, we want to look at some of the token metrics in terms of how many people are actually staking and whether people are actually catching on to what WISE is all about. OK, so if we go over to WISEinfo.io. Um, if you don't use this website, um, maybe you should start because it's definitely good for information, especially if you are holding this asset. It's good to keep an eye on it and find out exactly what's going on in terms of statistics and all that sort of stuff. But we're going to focus on the pie chart in terms of the staking activities. We can see that over 50% now of people who are holding WISE or have bought into WISE are actually staking which is good news because that means that the price floor is being raised continuously and there'll be a certain price point that we know that holding the asset, staking it long term, we know we're not going to go below. So that's definitely a good thing. 16% of that are holding, okay, just holding it in a wallet, liquid, and 32% in, in Uniswap, okay. So staked 50, well, that's over 50%. So of course, we know that the majority of people are staking that's brilliant news okay makes you kind of confident that you didn't make the wrong decision is staking for such a long term uh, long period of time and of course if we go back to the discussion about price floor uh, we know that at the moment it's approximately uh, cannot go down below this 25 cent mark 24.8 cent mark and i believe that might even be higher according to the founder um you know i don't know for certain but i know the last time i saw him speak about it we were around the 24.8 cent mark so that would be the worst case scenario for you of course we expect it to go up in price we're not expecting it to drop all the way down to 24 cents but if you were looking at what's the worst case scenario for me 25 25 cents would be the worst case scenario those that got in on the reservations uh, in the auctions would have got in at an average price of around 16 cents so at this point there's not really any way that you can lose money especially if you're staking and you're accruing interest it's sort of like a bond but with crypto so it's a win-win because share prices continuously go up when you invest in a bond so if we go over to the wise staking website you will see that the share price has actually increased by 10 percent as promised by the team and that happened on the 15th which would be yesterday i believe correct me if i'm wrong it might have been the 14th or the 13th i'm not sure haven't been looking at this every single day of course 
why would I be? I've staked it, which is in the back of my mind. It's a long-term hold position. Um, well, more than a long-term hold because it's a staking investment. So I'm accruing interest on that. As you can see, um, from 16 days ago, I have actually earned 901 wise, okay? And my other small stake, I've earned 2.99 wise. So if we work out exactly how much 901 wise is in today's uh, valuation, Okay, so we literally just do, uh, okay, let's just go back and see exactly how much that was again. 901.39 wise, 901.39 times, let's just say 59 cents, $531, okay? And obviously at its price peak of just under a dollar at 97 cents, you know, if it does go back there, then we're looking at $901 approximately and that's in only 16 days so if we look at that over a 12 month period you know we could approximately earn something like two thousand dollars a month if it was at a dollar price point and that would be twenty four thousand dollars a year so that would be definitely a good investment in terms of staking uh, residual income okay so i'm happy with that oh I, uh, well i most definitely will be happy with that if we can get back over a dollar of course but right now I'm definitely happy with the investment and I'm excited to see what the future holds for that. While we're talking about WISE, I might as well remind you, we do actually have a WISE merch store. I will leave a link in the description for you for that and you can get over and get your WISE merch if you are a fan of WISE, of course. This is a good conversational point. Um, if people don't know what WISE is, it gives you an opportunity for you to tell them exactly what WISE is. And you know, the more people that find out what it is, the more people invest in it, the more your investment increases in price, the more people stake, the more people hold, and etc. etc. So with the WISE price at the moment, it does appear to be falling, okay? But no need to panic. In my opinion, at the end of the day, things don't go up in straight lines. And if anybody told you that the chart was just going to go straight to the moon, um, give them a call and uh, have, a, have a go at them. Because at the end of the day, this is going to go up and it's going to go down. Um, if you're looking at the long term, I believe that the only way is up in terms of long term appreciation. Okay, so for me, it's not nothing to panic about, not nothing to worry about. And of course, let's not forget that this is backed by Ethereum. So there's a massive pool of Ethereum over here. Right over here, we see 84,691 Ethereum in this pool. And a lot of that is basically, you, you won't even be able to touch, uh, nobody will be able to touch it. It's ownerless liquidity so going back to staking if you do want to stake i'm going to leave my link in the description for you okay now by using my link you're actually going to get 10 percent extra shares on your wise okay so it makes sense to do that literally all you do is you go to create regular stake okay uh, you buy your wise first on uniswap of course and actually you don't actually have to buy wise before you come over to the wise the, the wise staking dashboard Right, you can actually just come straight over if you're holding Ethereum in your private wallet and you can create a regular stake that way and it will basically convert your Ethereum into WISE. I do recommend that way because at least then you're not paying the gas fees on Uniswap and then paying the gas fees on the WISE website. Okay, but you can just come over, create regular stake, put in exactly how much of your balance you want to put in. All right, if you wanted to put a thousand wires, you will put a thousand wires. Your staking durations are right here, but you can input those in manually anywhere from up to one day, even up to 42 years. You can stake for okay, and obviously, you will see my referral address in this section here, which will be grayed out. That's fine. And then, what you do is you just that that will be blue. You just click that button and create your stake and pay your gas fees. You can actually do insurance staking now. The difference between insurance staking and regular staking is if you try to cancel your regular stake uh, before the duration, uh, the, the, the staking period is over, you would incur a 90% penalty at the moment. I believe that does decrease as time goes by. But I mean, you know, if you're going to stake by regular staking, you want to know uh, uh, that you're not going to touch it at all because otherwise you will lose a lot of your investment. With insurance staking, if you do stake that way, you can only lose around 10% of your stake 
or ten percent of your position by doing that. Okay, and you can st you can only stake up to a maximum of three years by doing the insurance staking. So there's less interest that you can earn. However, there's less of a penalty if you do decide to kind of back out of your investment. All right, guys, I recommend a regular staking, of course, because that's what I do. You know, would I do an insurance stake at this point? Not really, because I've invested so much into this that I'm not prepared to lose any more money anyway. So I'm not prepared to risk any more of my, uh, of my capital into it. And that's only because, you know, as you can see, I've already got 230,000 wise, which works out at this current price, what it's at now, 59 cents, um, more than $100,000. So let's just uh, go back and check exactly how much that would be uh, today. So we've got 230, not including the 1,000 wires that we've got there, and not including all the interest earned, and not including all the interest that I'm earning off referrals, 230,803 times 0.59 will be $136,000, 173, okay? So of course, I've got quite a lot of money in there already. I'm all about diversifying, so I am diversifying my money into other investments at the moment. Investments like Fala, okay, and other cryptocurrencies, and you know, other things outside of crypto, which maybe I'm thinking about doing another channel to talk about those things as well. But, I mean, that's about it for now, guys. Remember, the link is in the description for WISE. All right, guys, so you can use my link, get 10% extra shares. Of course, you're getting a better price than what people bought in over here. So it still makes sense if you can afford to kind of make that investment, put it to your back of your mind, come back in 12 months or however long you stake for, and everything will be hunky-dory. Of course, you can see my battery is about to die, so it's a great time to end the video. Subscribe, like, and comment, and I'll see you in the next one.